Welcome to Aiton. Enjoy your stay in Aiton. Hail, Wanderer. Would you spare a moment? I have a favor to ask you. In appearances, perhaps. I'm just an Alpha that needs your help. I have a few belongings to sell, and unfortunately, I've done little to endear myself to Aiton's folk. Will you sell them in my stead? The arrangement is simple. I give you an item, and you sell it. I take a cut, you keep the profit. And will repeat until I have nothing to sell. Understand? I thought you had the look of a trader about you. I have several items for you to sell. If you prefer, you could just buy them all now from me and sell them later. As you wish. The items are in acceptable condition, if nothing else, but they might stand a little polish here and there. Take my silverware, for example. It's somewhat tarnished, but Ban Ron could use the metal. If you melted it down, he'd likely pay more for it. I want you to sell it. Ban Ron, the local smithy, will have use for the silver, I'm sure. If you process the silver down to a raw form, he might pay more for it. Welcome to the smithy. Welcome to the Clanging Hammer. Don't see many new faces in Aiton these days. My forge is open. So you're Ratipa's proxy. I heard that someone was helping him out of his money problems. Well, that misfortune couldn't have happened to a nicer person. He was the richest Alfar in town, until he lost his shirt in the war. But that looks to be good silver. I'll take it off your hands. Before Talarain fell to ruin, it was Aiton's fields and villagers that stocked and supplied the various citadels there. But the war hit us hard. Bandits plagued the roads. Even Rond Farm has burned to soot. They have been lingering around the wolds. Be cautious on the roads out there. Those freemen like to sneak up on wanderers. Forge is yours, whenever you need. Hello again, stranger. What do you need? I never thought I'd see the day when I'd be happy to see such a paltry sum. I suppose the townsfolk are happy on my behalf. But let the past lie. I've another item for you. My kerchief. Slightly, uh, worn, but the material is special of the sort alchemists employ for handling reagents. Askel Thorin might buy it. He's a stubborn one, but he's weak at haggling. See what you can get out of him. Askel Thorin, the local alchemist, is interested in it. 
The cloth is normally used for handling sensitive reagents and potions. See what kind of price you can get out of him. minute I thought the damn Freeman had fancied to rob me. Welcome. I offer some alchemical items if you are interested. So, Ratifer's new errand runner is here. Hmm. Ratifer's been in town for years, but this is the first time I've heard anything from him since he returned from Tewilly over ten years ago. A messy business. Not unlike alchemy. I've seen that rag of his, and I know its virtues. I'll part with some coin for it. Ruffians and bandits. The scatters all over the walls. It's dangerous wandering outside of town. My wife and assistant. She helps me run the shop. Although sometimes she creates more problems than she fixes. Very well. Good day, traveler. You should speak with Askel if you're here to shop. He won't even let me keep the books anymore after my last mistake. I want to help him, but he won't let me near his ledgers. Well, if you can undo my mistake, perhaps Askel will let me help him again. I sent out several invoices the other day, but I made a slight arithmetic error that might cost us dearly. None of the customers seem to have noticed yet. Can you recollect those invoices discreetly? Oh, thank you. There's five invoices in total. Four went to the townsfolk. The last was to go to the Warsworn Fortress, Helmgard, with a traveling merchant. When you have them all, bring them back to me. Oh, and don't mention this to Askel. Nice talking to you. What is it you need, stranger? How go my affairs? And I hope you've gotten out of Asku what you wanted for it. I have another item I want you to sell. A pair of daggers. Finwick Ivor collects weapons. Gaudy, gem-encrusted, ceremonial ones. But weapons nonetheless. Some gem socketing may be of use. Take whatever you can for them. Just get them out of my sight. Sell them to Finwick Ivor. He's fancied himself a collector of these kinds of things. He's quite vain. If you socket a gem or two into them, I'm sure he'll pay more for the daggers.
Welcome to the smithy. Huh? Stranger to Aiton, I'm the law in this town. Keep the peace and you are welcome to stay. If not, then you had best leave. If you need to trade, visit Banron, our smithy, and Askel deals in alchemy. And there's a general dealer staying at the inn. Ratifer's aid, right? Let me take a look at what you have there. By the gods! All Alpha know these daggers. These were given to the heroes of the Battle of Galifor Plains. Ratta forgot these for saving Rathir from the Tuatha. Will you look at that stone? Shining like the day it was set into the blade. I'll take these off your hands. They must be preserved. I am the law of the town. Aiton needed protection, and I didn't see anyone else willing to do the job. I took it upon myself to keep Aiton safe. Someone needed to do it. Keep the peace. Huh? What's this? 